universe is massive, almost infinite in its size, containing stars, black holes, nebulas, planets, comets, asteroids, and moons. Much of the universe remains unexplored. Even some of the planets closer to home. One of these planets is called Uranus. About 4.6 billion years ago, the planet Uranus begins to form around the sun. Four billion years ago, a massive icy body twice the size of the Earth collides with Uranus. This causes the planet to rotate on its side like a bowling ball. For most of human history, we have only known about six planets. This all changed on March 13th, 1781. William Herschel discovers the seventh planet in the universe. It's three times the size of Earth, making it the third largest planet in our solar system. Originally, Herschel wanted to name his planet after King George III. Unfortunately for George, nobody liked him, and so the idea was scrapped. Another name considered for the planet was Neptune, which hadn't been discovered yet, so the name was still available. Eventually, the name of the planet was decided to be Uranus, after the Greek god of the sky, making Uranus the only planet to be named after a Greek god and not a Roman one. In the year 1986, the probe Voyager 2 flies past Uranus, making it the first and only expedition sent to the planet. It's unfortunate that Uranus's name has caused it to become such a joke in the universe because the planet is truly interesting and mysterious, with many unique qualities that other planets do not have. It's just a real shame that nobody respects it. Ah, who am I kidding? It's hilarious. Let's keep milking the name. Okay? All right. There's Uranus right there. You see it? You see it? Dad was my anus.